So over here is the surgical draping. What we are going to practice today is a patient going for abdominal surgery. Now how the draping is going to happen? Now we have positioned a patient and we have kept the general surgery uh, drape over here. And for a practical purpose, I'm just not wearing my mask. Okay, so we are going to make the surgical side clean. So I'm just going to repeat it because it's just simulation only. Okay, so throw it out. Okay, now we are going to start the draping. Now we have kept a sterile pack for general surgery. It is there. We are going to open it. So we got one more trolley sheet. If you got additional trolley to keep the instruments, we have a trolley sheet. And we also got five. Now it sits. Okay. And uh, sponges, that is the mopping part. And uh, so always when mopping parts are there, the thing is you have to make sure there is a tie and pull the tie and see it is intact. And uh, hopefully everyone knows what is mean by this blue color. Anybody knows? What is this blue color? Nobody knows. Okay. This is known as X-ray or RETEC. That means suppose when you are going for an abdominal surgery, if the ghost miss inside and you try it in that abdomen, you may miss it. So but that time we can shoot for an imaging intensifier or X-ray and with the X-ray, this line will be visible and you can find it out where exactly there. And as for patient safety, any ghost pieces which you are using on patient must have this ray tech. If this ray tech is not there, you can use it. And one more thing, suppose if surgeon is asking for a small ghost piece, you can cut from here and give because that is that may not have the ray tech. That is against the nurse safety concern. So every ghost piece I have to literally open and see because what time there are certain time happen is inside maybe some something else will be there. So you have to literally open everything, make sure that it is intact. Okay. Now I got okay two one large trip. Okay, I got two large trip. So it is written also two large trip, and the white part which is uh, you can see over here is that is adhesive. So once you remove the adhesive, it will be stuck onto the patient, and you have to side drape also small drape. And first, what we are going to do is we will start from the side. Okay. So keep it in this way, okay, now your hand like this, okay, because when you are putting it, it is not going to touch anywhere else. Did you notice how she is holding it? Okay, so uh, now you can, so we wanted to expose only this incisional area, okay, so only that area, so you can cover almost here and whenever usually when you go for a laparotomy, even though the incision area is big, but they may big, make a big opening, I mean big area to open it while draping. Why it is, is maybe some unanticipated issues and they may able to extend the incision. That time if the drape is only this much, they can't extend it. So they will keep it always bigger. Okay. So yeah, attach it and one can come to the other side. No. Yeah. Wait a minute. Okay, so now for practical purpose, we just wanted to redo it again. We are not going to remove the plaster and sticking it. We are just going to place it. Now it was wrong because see now actually when she has done, I don't know whether you noticed or not. So when she applied this particular part, anyway, first thing is we did not remove the adhesive part. Okay, she put it like this. If she is putting like this, that means her gloves, sterile part is touched here. So that is a wrong practice. Now ideally, what she has to do is, she has to go out, remove her gown, remove her gloves and reapply it again. Okay, then you can come and attach from the other side, take this. Anyway, we have broken the sterility integrity, but it doesn't matter, we will just learn it. Yes. Now from that side you come, okay, place it on the other side. Okay, just leave it as it is. Okay, now both the side you have draped. Now the good thing is, when you draped in the side, the good thing is you can come close to the patient also because this area you have draped. Okay, now what you are going to do is you are keeping, yeah, just leave it, it's okay. If it is falling down, just keep it slightly up. Okay, 
okay wait can you hold like this no up up this don't touch can you get some artery force of center there three four four five okay okay either you can place it or just come close to it okay then this end has to go to the foot end no 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 don't put it down okay yeah now first place this area adhesive tape place it place it okay now go down unfold it down unfold it yes beautiful go completely go completely yes very nice now remove the trolley from there okay leave it okay take the other bit sheet come to the top end yeah give one end to her yeah you take the other end fits one part fits the no fits the no see now what happened to us when you are keeping it over here this part already got touched here so that means this part is unsterile now you are again bringing into a cleaned area ideally you are supposed to discard this strip and open a new one so because the what you have to do is you there is no need to touch here you just dig it because it is going to the bottom so come close to it close to it close to it okay now fits it fits first fits there first okay yeah then unfold it completely yes okay so now we exposed only the limited area of the patient very simple actually only for drape but there are a lot of minor area if you are not careful that we may make a mistake is it clear okay. so this again got a sticky part which also you can attach to the drape finally the thing is it is not to keep the waste or goes anything there are certain times we may use suction tube or titrami machine so such situation all those things you can keep it safe it will not fall down and it is not a place to keep instrument also no because there are certain times if it is sharp it may make a hole over here and it may fall down and it's if you are checking only one place there is if some weight comes the traction may come so it may again go down pulling with the drape so you have one more adhesive so you just remove it place it over stick it over there so it will be fixed to the drape is it clear